So I haven't made any videos where I've skated around Grant Park. So today, that's all the video is going to be about. Let's give this park some love. So one of the things I like to do on this park is try to do different tricks up this stair set. So let's warm up with that. I guess we'll just start back here. That way we can get, get just a little bit of speed. Wow, nice. And let's try to kick flip. Kick flip first try. So next, I think I want to try to do a tray flip. I think if we just flick it fast enough, we can make it look smoother than that. All right, that was a very quick tray flip. Looked really nice. All right, let's try to do a 360 backside flip. Maybe. Ah, uh, first try? <laughs> Looked pretty cool. Okay, let's just try to end the spot with the line. So kick flip, tail, kick flip out, and then fakie big up the stairs. Yeah, let's try that. All right, this feels like enough speed. Ah. Uh, I got them. I got everything I wanted. Oh, what's going on with my screen? Wow, it's just a black cloud. It's taking over my game. Yeah, I can totally play like I can play in the dark. What is even happening? Okay, so I see these blocks here and I'm wondering if they're actually grindable. So I need to find a way to get up there. I guess I can start right about here, see how much speed I'm going to need. I can just pop off of this, push a little bit more, and well, I have the speed I need. Almost, but I feel like it'd probably be easier if I do something else. So there's a ramp right here, and there's a little ramp right there. So if we start back here, we can, I guess, do this, and then pop into this, gain some speed, and then maybe an inward heel smith yeah that's gonna work and i think the toughest part about this is just gonna be the inward heel like i feel like i could probably lock into a grind pretty easy on that yeah okay the inward heel is definitely the toughest i wasn't really locked in that smith so i want to go back and redo it okay that was more locked in it was sketchy landing anyways but i'll take it So how about a tray flip to blunt to fakey? Yeah. So I think the toughest part about this is just going to be rolling away because there is a block right behind it. And if I roll away cleanly, I might hit that block. So I'm going to try to avoid that. Ah, uh, man. Yep. I, I said it was going to happen and it did. So it looks like I'm going to have to pop out of it. It's not what I wanted to do. But uh, it should be a lot cleaner if we do. So I can just pop out like that and roll away straight. Just like that. <laughs> Could have been a lot cleaner, but I'm limited on space. And I can't show the replay because this black thing is back. What is going on? So I wonder if it's possible to actually clear that block instead of just grinding it. Like just go over the whole thing. Yeah, probably. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. But I imagine it's possible. Um, it's probably actually easier with a grab. So if I was to like pop up and do an indie, yeah, that's pretty easy. So let's not worry about the grab and let's just try to front side flip it. So I wonder if I can get more speed just by popping into these ledges right here and pumping down. Maybe the game will give me a lot of speed for that. I don't know. So pop, pump. Oh yeah, that feels... A lot easier <laughs> so it was giving me more speed off of that I was able to get a front side flip okay so how about a nolly 360 front side double kick flip that would be pretty cool okay I feel like that was pretty clean I mean given the situation I'm in So we do have a challenge from Jake Silverman and it says hit the triple ledge and alternate between backside and front side on each ledge. So that's pretty sick. I want to try to do like a couple different grinds to find out what's going to work best. I would like to get like maybe a nose slide, tail slide and then nose slide again, but I really don't know. Something like that. Ah, uh, uh, almost. 
Okay, it might work. I want to. I definitely want to try this now. So what I'd really like to do is a nose slide to a shove it tail slide and then kick flip into another nose slide. That would probably be the best I can do on this. Ah, uh, that was so close. Everything was too sketchy though. I want to do better than that. Ah, uh, ah, uh, no. <sighs> Seriously? Yes, yes, I got it. <laughs> so our next challenge comes from not underscore Logan and OO Dreamers OO. They both want the same challenge. I guess I'll do it the way Dreamers did. I guess I'll start up here. And hopefully I'll be able to get this. <laughs> I don't know. I've never tried it. Wow. That's so far not a good start. But first try. <laughs> wow. Okay. I want to do something better on that. So maybe a tray flip to fakey would look cool. I'm not really sure. I really can't think of a trick that would just be awesome on it. Oh, yeah. Nice. Okay, so now I want to try to do a backside 180 to nose blunt if I can get over there. Ah, almost. But I, I would want it to look better than that. <laughs> Whatever he was doing was not what I wanted. Well, at least I know it's possible to get out that far. That's that's the main thing. Now I can just work around it and try to get something cool. That tree is annoying. Come on. Got the nose blunt. Yes. So our next challenge comes from Young Stony 420 and if you don't know who that is, he does a lot of Skater XL videos now. His compilations are actually really good and he does some pretty hard stuff sometimes. So if you're interested in that, go check out his channel. And it's this gap right here. It's actually pretty big. Uh, I think what I want to do is start from back here, then roll through here, pop into this, roll through that. And I really don't know if that's going to give me enough speed. Like, it's not a lot at all. So let's try backside flip it. Nope, not a lot at all. So let's try it the other way. Let's try it with this right here and hopefully gain a lot of speed. Well, I gained a little bit, but I'm hoping I can just backside flip this. Ah, okay, I got it. But it was a late pop. So let's try to get it without a late pop. So I'm wondering if I can gain some more speed from the next ledge. Like if I gain some speed off of that and then pop into this next ledge and then try it. Oh yeah, it feels like I am going a lot faster. Now, let's just clear all the way over here. Forget about the quarter pipe gap. <laughs> and I'm not really sure what trick to do first. Maybe um, a nolly bigger heel. That probably look cool across it. But let's see if this works and nolly bigger heel. Ah. Wow, I really screwed that up. Ah, uh, that looked really nice. So next, I want to try to do a 360 heel over it. I didn't gain any speed off of that. Hopefully, this will be better. Yep, okay, 360 heel. Oh, ooh, <laughs> I got to make that look better. Oh. All right, so now I want to try to do the whole thing, like even the ledges on the side. So if I can make it over that ledge at the end, that would be cool. Yep, the whole thing. Now I did late pop right here. I late popped a lot right there, but I was still able to get over it. So I'm just going to take it anyway. So there is a lot of creative stuff here to do, but I think I'm going to end the video here. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, make sure you hit that like button. If you're new, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that bell so you actually get notified when I upload. Let me know what you think about this video in the comments below. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.